It is the biggest donation of food in the history of Feeding San Diego. A local meat company just donated a million and a half dollars worth of burgers, but not just any burgers. These are plant-based burgers. KSI's Dan Plant joins us live from outside of Feeding San Diego, and he's got <laughs> more on this. Hey, Dan. Here we go. That whole burger revolution is happening here. The plant-based burgers, you know, they're over at Carl's Jr. They're over at Burger King. They're popping up in all kinds of restaurants that never would have possibly considered selling anything but meat. Uh, but here we are. Uh, this is a place called Jensen's Meats down in Otai, established long, long time ago by Mr. Jensen. And they've been in business in San Diego and donating, but quite honestly, to Feeding San Diego and other charities for many, many years. But what happened is they came up with this new product, this plant-based burger, and they said, well, you know what, let's not only sell these things, let's get them to the local food banks, particularly Feeding San Diego, so we can help people in our community basically get exposed to these plant-based burgers. Now, I don't know how everybody is going to react to this. Some people are like shaking their heads right now at home saying, I'm never going to eat a plant-based burger. Uh, but the truth is, is a lot of people are eating these things and realizing that they're not that different from meat. The texture is a little different, but, you know, what you're doing is you're going from an actual animal to a plant-based product, so it can't be that bad, right? Uh, so, uh, yes, earlier there was a massive donation from Jensen's Meats to Feeding San Diego, and that food is getting ready to go out and feed our community. So earlier today, got a chance to check up, check out the burgers, and here's what we found. Talk about neighbor helping neighbor. Feeding San Diego just received a mind-blowing donation from a local meat company. They've gotten donations from Jensen's Meats before, but this one, this one is something else. Oh my gosh, this is the largest food donation that Feeding San Diego has ever received. It's 500,000 pounds of plant-based patties. At 500,000 boxes, that is 2 million plant-based burgers being donated. While Jensen's has been a leader in the meat business since the 1950s, this is 2022, and they've made the pivot to add those plant-based products. So we've partnered with Jensen's before um, with donations on a much smaller scale and of their meat products, and they are now getting into the plant-based patty business, and because they are a San Diego uh, company. They really wanted to give back to the community. I need you to move these into here so that we can uh, move the ball. A community that unfortunately is seeing continued need for help putting food on their tables. The volunteers over at Feeding San Diego have never been busier as the hunger situation is not getting better. No, it's not getting better. Actually, it's, it's, it's increasing. The need is increasing, we are seeing. We are doing these distributions 10 to 12 a month throughout the county. And we thought the numbers were going to go down at some point, but they're really not going down. So as the volunteers load boxes full of produce and pasta and rice, there is a new item on the menu for anyone who chooses. The plant-based revolution is here, and the partnership between Jensen's Meats and Feeding San Diego will be sharing that revolution with anyone who needs help. We actually, whenever we're giving out food, we have had requests from all across the area. Um, for vegan and vegetarian alternatives. So it is being very well received. Some people don't know anything about it and are learning. <laughs> Some people don't know anything about and they're learning about plant-based products. And of course, there's all kinds of them. They have the plant-based chicken, they have the plant-based you know, variety of things that are coming out right now. Those little breakfast sausages, by the way, are really good. The uh, plant-based ones with the maple syrup on them. So, uh, all right, so here's what's gonna happen is they're going to start distributing these burgers to our community and tomorrow is a big day right here right here at feeding san diego on wapples street that's right in sereno valley they're going to have another drive through so you don't even have to get out of your car and with these drive throughs you get like 50 pounds of food right so they give you the rice and the pasta they give you the vegetables and all those things and, you know, traditionally they would give you some kind of a frozen protein, as they call it, some kind of a meat. But in this case, people will now have the option. Would you like a box full of veggie burgers or would you like some, you know, frozen chicken or something like that? So little by little, this whole veggie thing is obviously taking over our society with fast food restaurants now getting involved in it as well. And food banks now getting involved in it as well. And, you know, some people would say that the plant-based burgers are a nice, healthy alternative 
for a lot of people who might be eating too much meat. Uh, doctors recommend that, you know, whatever. There's all kinds of different diets that you can be under. But this is really, really a wonderful, wonderful thing to see that there's a, a corporate family member out there, Jensen's Meats down in Otay, that is so generous that they're donating all of this, all of this product. And then, again, this is two million, two million burgers, 500,000 boxes with 40 in each box. And when you show up, you'll get a box of 40 for your family. That's enough to feed you for about a week, hopefully. So that's what's going on out here. And of course, cash donations are always welcome because they couldn't keep this operation going without the cash, the volunteers, and of course, the donations of food. And then let's not forget this. They're all about food rescue. Food rescue, they've sort of revolutionized that, taking a lot of food that would normally get thrown away, gonna be repurposed and onto people's dinner tables. And it is sad though, however, to find out that uh, the hunger problem through this past two years is not getting better. The need is actually getting worse, which is pretty sad. So we're outside of Feeding San Diego, you guys. Throw it back yeah. to you. Have you tried the plant-based burgers, Dan? I, I know you like your plant-based diets. Have I? Yeah. I, I haven't eaten meat in 30 years. That's all I eat is the plant-based burgers. Is the plant-based burgers. burgers. That's my thing. That's your jam. Yeah. Mr. Plant eats the plants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plant with the plan. All right. The, yeah. Which which brand do you like? Um, you know, I the Morning Star was like the first one I ever right. tried, and they have those really good breakfast sausages too. Okay. Uh, but there's a variety of products. Yeah, out Beyond there that Meat are, I think has really, one that's popular. Really good. Yeah. Yeah. All right, buddy. Yeah. Well, good. Thank you, my friend. All right, man. We'll check in with you in a little while. You got it. Happy Friday. All right, brother. You too. Yep.